Hey, it's praying time. It's me, Kimberly and Elise, the prayer ministers. We are back, but this time it is with our commercial praise reports. Praise God. It all started with simply approaching God, just simply saying, God, I want a commercial. I want a commercial just for me and uh, my daughter together. That's what I said. So I love it. Just really like that opportunity to have a commercial of just me and her god is so faithful not only did he bless us with one he blessed us actually with two different commercials where it's just me and her and then the third commercial is like a bonus one for me it's just a mother's day award commercial and so i just have to give god the praise give god the glory and yep i could have went straight to the person and said hey uh, you know, you, you got the power to access to do a uh, commercial for me and da, da da da. But you know what? I went to God first. So I had to share this praise report with you all, you know, so that God would get the glory. I'm not bragging of anything in my own right, but it's so God can get the glory and to so encourage all of you. Seek God first because sometimes we go to people first, we, we, we go to who we think. Uh, has what we need and can give us what we want and this that and the other and we're all going through something um you know in these last in the last of evil days so the most important thing to do continue to seek god first but go to him first before you approach anybody about anything up uh, go to god first hallelujah go to the throne room of grace hallelujah and lay your petition out hallelujah humbly respectfully and boldly you can go hallelujah and let him know what it is that you desire but i also want to encourage us too we really have to choose to live for him hallelujah we've got to have a made up mind that we're living for god almighty that we want to glorify him that we want to lift him up that we will give him the honor and the credit and the praise that's truly due his name that we won't take any of that for ourselves that we'll always know that it was god that opened the door for us it was god that opened windows and doors for us and he opened them expediently immediately right hallelujah expeditiously <laughs> hallelujah so we give god the glory for all that he has done and so kick back relax and i've got all the commercials in this slideshow so that way, if you were having trouble being able to watch them, um, now you won't have trouble because I I put it in a nice praise report slideshow for all of you at this praying time. And like I said, God bless you. It's praying time. No, I'm standing in the gap for you. I'm praying for you. And let's enjoy these commercials. we always want to make the most of each and every opportunity that if you have not accepted jesus christ that you should repeat this salvation prayer dear lord jesus i know that i'm a sinner and i ask for your forgiveness i believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead i turn from my sins and invite you to come into my heart and life i ask for the holy spirit to dwell in me, to guide me, and to teach me all things. I choose to trust and follow you as a son of God and Lord and Savior. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. So if you said that with a sincere heart, you just got saved, and we welcome you to the kingdom of God. Your next steps, download the Bible app. I've got the link there for you. You can download it on your cell phone, your computer, tablet, Whatever smart device you're using, the second step, get a good pa paper parallel study Bible with, say, the King James Version and New Living Translation or New King James Version, your preference of translation, so it can help you to understand the scriptures better. All right, you want to be reading the Bible every day. Thirdly, I'm praying with you and you pray with me as well that God will lead you to a good church home if you don't have one and that you be planted, rooted and established in the word of God. Salvation is just the first step. Hallelujah. This is a day in and day out work in progress step journey that you're embarking on. So you want to make sure that you are reading the Bible every day. 
Hallelujah. And doing your best to put into practice what you're learning step by step. And don't feel bad. Sometimes you don't pass the test the first time. Guess what? You'll get another chance. Praise God. Our God is a God of another chance. But we want to pray that we are learning to pass the test more quickly now as we see the signs of the time. We want to redeem that time for we see that the time is what? Evil. So make the most of your time. Hallelujah. And let let share on your social media pages that you got saved today. All right. It's me, Kimberly, and Elise Clayton, the Pick TV managers for Wisconsin and the programming managers. We help to make sure that those channels stay running on the Pick TV network, all 60 channels. But we're coming to say Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. And Elise has a special poem for me that I'd like to share with all of you. It's called Mama's Hand by Elise and Clayton. Mama's hand was always there to hold from a baby till 10 years old. Mama's hand was always there from when I cried or felt well blue, even when mama never knew. But mama's hand was, mama's hand always came through. Mama's hand reached out for me when I pulled away and had a very bad day. Yeah, mama's hand was there from the worst moments of my life to the happiest days. Mama's hand was always there. The love she gives can't be replaced. One of my favorite days is Mother's Day because I can return the love that Mama's hand gave me every day. But this is my favorite day to do it. I look back on my pictures and see that Mama's hand was always there. No matter how hard life was, Mama's hand was always there. Life was hard, but Mama's hand was always there no matter how hard life got. She never left me. We walked at the park. Mama's hand was there every time I fell down. Mama's hand was there. A mother loves go far. Mother love goes so far, but Mama's hands goes further. Mama's hand took me to church, even though it would be cold. She's faithful and still is. There's no. Sometimes I don't. I didn't like going. I'm thankful that she did because if she didn't take me, I don't know where I would be. There was no human hand like Mama's hand. She was there when people I needed wasn't. So thank you, Mom, for everything you did and all the love you show. Wow, isn't that beautiful? It's titled Mama's Hand, and that is Elise's very own inspiration. And so, Elise, what do you want to say to the mothers? Know that you're appreciated and that your kids really love you. All right, and then on three, one, two, three. Happy Mother's Day! Thanks for listening and watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, select notification bell, and share. And remember, it's praying time. Don't be a stranger. Come back again.